you know what? Given the fact that we have such a change of pace, let's let, let's just throw the pace off even further. While the ads are going, it, son of a biscuit. <laughs> Really hope that everyone is doing well. For those that are hopping in, welcome. This is the Road to Dusk. You can call me Road, Dusk, anything that you would call a friend. I am a dream usher focusing on sleep, dreams, and the imagination to help create an environment where people can learn to be the better versions of themselves. And if y'all don't know this game, well, get ready for a little bit of fun because we are doing Parasite E. Give me a moment, the game is actually a little on the large side, I just realized. Just need to scooch things just a little bit, get it in frame. There we go. You may notice that, uh... Y you may notice that the... <laughs> I don't, in fact, know this game. Okay, so... Parasite Eve is one of the more popular and rare uh, sci-fi horrors on the PlayStation 1. Yes, this is originally a PS1 game. It came out in 98, actually. <laughs> and hold on, checking a whole bunch of stuff. But yeah, I'm gonna let the music go for a bit. Oh, I just realized that the audio was doubling. And I need to turn this down. Because holy moly, I had all of my audio stuff mixed up. <laughs> but really hope that everyone is doing well tonight. Yes, we are having a very prominent change of pace. And I am looking forward to this, honestly. This was originally meant to be a um, event between the Nukes Heroes and ourselves. But they are not in the best head headspace right now because of a headache but yeah oh there's the ad <laughs> dadgummit okay all right we'll set up a new game while this is going there's a nice little opening cinematic to go with this. Also, do not be surprised if you hear or see me munching along because I am, I have food. Let me get the audio just a little bit louder there. Oh, shoot. Now you guys can hear my keyboard. <laughs> Thank you for the full care package. Alrighty, dighty. Thank you. Ah. So this takes place in 97, 1997, and it is Christmas Day. So if people want to claim that Die Hard is a Christmas movie, by the same logic, this is a Christmas game. <laughs> oh, I'm glad I can still hear the TTS. Actually, let me have it to our stream can hear the TTS. So here we are, we have our custodian. And if you really want an example on like older graphics, here we go. What's wrong? You're the one who wanted to come to the opera. Why do we have Christmas as a genre, but not autumnal equinox? I mean, good question. So we're playing as Aya Bree. 25, occupation, an NYPD officer. We can change her name, but I'm going to keep it as is. I don't know. I just... You're right. I'll try to have more fun. Well, I'm going to keep it as Aya, just because I am still waiting for my working... PS1 memory card to get back to me 
because the folks that I had sent my original PS2 to to get uh, repaired never got it repaired. Keep using uh, any and all excuses under the sun. Uh, under the sun, and now they're having they're giving every excuse under the sun and saying that it's a waiting game for me to even get my shit back that they said that they would take and that they would ship to another location of theirs. That's too far away for me to go to pick up physically. So we need to go John Wick on them. Got it. Yep. <laughs> Effectively. Um, so the PS1, um, the, the PS1 memory card that I was given with the new PS2 that I have currently oh, too far does away. not actually work. So I have no way to save this given Parasite Eve was originally a, P a PS1 game. While the PS2 is backwards compatible, PS1 games still require their own memory card to function and to be saved. And yes, too far away. Like, <laughs> Celine, I can probably give you a rough uh, location because I have been waiting about a month now for this thing to get shit back to me. Like I'm too far away? No closer than you. But it would be more of a trip for you to have to go over there than for you to visit me. Aren't you glad you decided to go out with me? I never, I even had my dad get the best seats for us tonight. So lighten up. We're going to have a great time. Because You'll see. I'm just saying, I just got my car back today and holy shit, do I need to get out of town? Like, as in a, like, okay, you don't have to clarify on that, but the phrase get out of town has me concerned. Like, I need to drive further than my office. X3. Oh. I, I just sent you the info. Uh, you know so me. I'm a nomad. <laughs> okay, just had me worried because I'm so much more used to folks saying, oh, like, get out of town as in, like, I did some bad shit. Let's see. Can what bad I... shit would I even do? I have no idea, but then again, a lot of towns don't I'm really like stupid. to X3. A lot of towns don't really like to give explanations on how they how and why they discriminate against people. Also, hold on, let me do a quick thing. Uh scale filtering we'll do um no, that just made it. Sorry, I'm trying to mess with the visuals so that you guys can see it well. Does that look clear to you Time guys? For gay stuff. Unfortunately, there is no gay stuff in here. At least to my knowledge. Uh, scale fill train. Let's try the bicubic. Um, that's not too far for me. Remind me later to work through logistics with Yad. Yeah. X3. Unfortunately, I don't really have enough money oh, to pay you for stuff. the trouble. Always gay stuff. Uh, sorry. Also, hey, Toby. So I'm trying to see which, um... Which way of trying to have a... A, fil a scale filter on this best works with... Road. When have I ever asked you to pay me for literally anything ever? I know, X3. but I still feel bad. Sorry, I'm also trying to work on... Are you guys okay with how the graphics are currently? Because obviously, like, over 20-year-old graphics trying to be casted onto, like, modern technology causes some visual tearing. Considering this stuff was more suited for CRTs, and those with how they were made were able to make things look so much cleaner. We don't really have that with um, uh, with modern with with Looks modern like tech like PS this that very me. much prefers pixel perfect. Only adjustment I consider is making sure the aspect ratio is the same as the old CRT monitors. 
Over Actually, twenty years old. You calling me and sis old then? <laughs> yes, and me included, considering this game was made the year I was fucking born. <laughs> All right, actually, considering you mentioned, um... I have gray hairs. Toby, I count as old. Considering you guys want this back in 4x3... Road is baby. I have an easy way to fix this. So, let's reset the console. We shall migrate to 4x3. Because, oh, it! I have some stuff that I need to turn off. Where's the watermark? Because, system configuration, screen size, set it to four by three. And then actually I should probably switch my I have had TV. one gray hair, to... but I think it had more to do with where possibly it, splashing it? bleach water in my hair at work, but unknown. Picture mode. Uh, where is... Aspect ratio. That'll Isn't give you normal. gray hairs, too. Yes. X3. Uh, aspect yeah, backlight is normal. Noise reduction, adaptive contrast. Sorry, also trying to mess with things on my uh, TV and whatnot to try and have this set to the resolution that it ought to be. Push all the buttons. Sidebar. Got to do this. Uh, we'll do standard. No. Nope. Uh, picture. Oh wait, standard definition converts standard definition to 640 by 480, because that's a 4 by 3 ratio. Hide sidebar. But that is still not what I am wanting. Let's get rid of the overlay lighting, because I forgot that I had that. Ugh. Okay, so let's go back to the browser. Here are some memories for you guys, I guess, when it comes to uh, PS2 stuff and older consoles, because the, the fact that the PS2 had its own, like, so-called browser, where you could check, like, the data on your memory card, as well as, like, your games... All right, let's see how well this fixes stuff. Uh, doesn't quite seem like... All right, studio mode. I might need to move it in here. Yeah, because for whatever reason, it's still stretching it to yeah for whatever reason it's still stretching it sing a song of suffering while you work at this um actually it does remind me i have i had worked on a uh a more full parody of Piano Man given Sunday. You want me to sing that or do you want me to just sing something else? This is getting better. Go for it. Uh, well, I'll have to pull the lyrics. Give me a moment while I am. That is probably as good as I'm going to get without pulling hairs. So, okay. And let me scoop myself. Uh, 
Oh, and why is my overlay... Why is my overlay info like this? There we go. All right, things should be better now. And of course I'm looking angry, completely on accident. And let me Angie add face. image, all event logos, and is a big, and yes, I, so a few things, you will see that we have um, the temp, the optional donathon officially set on Kofi. So if you guys want to be in on that, me. well done. <laughs> that was on accident, but hell yeah, I, I feel accomplished with that. Okay. So okay, let's go through that whole song and dance again. Oh, hey. No tyke. No tyke! How's it going? Also, let me get the parody going while we have to go through this cutscene again. Yeah, because it is unskippable. It is a nice, pretty cinematic, but fuck it. So, the parody lyrics that I have, and I worked with Flarg on this too, it's 9, well, rather, it it's 10 p.m. So on a Saturday. Well, I'm doing this good. is a Wednesday, but How fuck it. You? The regular crowd shuffles in. There's a mod on standby waiting patiently as my ass is surely being kicked. And alas, Howdy, was so no me. time for a revelry. No place for a well-deserved song. Yet the cheers for an encore kept me to live. As I say in the adventurer's call, I am almost fucking dead. I'm almost fucking dead. Somebody help me, I need it please. I just wanted to get fucking close. Do you want me to strip? I don't think Twitch will like that. Yet here you are begging for more. <laughs> All right, let's. Let's skip through this again. Ah. Sorry, this game is kind of picky and annoying with um, with me trying to use the PS2 uh, controller with it when having to input names or using the menu. I have to switch whether it's an analog mode or not. I don't know, I just... You're right, I'll try to have more fun. I just now realized I was watching in 340p and it actually looks pretty good like that. X3. Huh. Well, it's kind of befitting considering, like, the quality for, like, PS1 and PS2 was predominantly 480 if I remember right. Unfortunately, I don't have, like, a nice little low-poly version of, my, of myself to commemorate with this, but <laughs> we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Skip that. Okay, yeah. Yeah, but you've got the pretty eyes, and those get lost in 340p. <laughs> what, do you need me to, like, come in a little closer? Oh, but then again, you'll lose bro. the shoulder. I would love a low-poly version of myself, but that I would like cost money. Idea. HM. But speaking of money, though, I did mention that we do have the, um, optional donathon going on. Um... While the the base goal two hundred fifty dollars that goes to savings and the other money as well if need be, but in an ideal situation that extra money after the first two hundred and fifty dollars will go to new assets for stream. Whether it's new games, whether it's new. Oh, this goes by. Father, please give me permission to marry Ava. 
Unfortunately, this is unskippable. I gotta read it. I forbid it! You know well what will happen if you do. Those who succumb to her beauty all die in horrible ways. You don't understand. She is the one that has suffered after the deaths. Also, do I sound better right now or no? She is evil! Guard, grab her! And burn her at the stake! Because I turned off the noise suppression on my, um, on my mic in OBS because I was told that noise suppression is not as good for higher pitch voices, which my voice is kind of high pitch. If you are sensitive to her to the stake, then I ask you take my life along with hers! Edward! Well, this fun bit goes on. Um, like I said, we have the optional donathon going on. Um, whatever money we get past $250, if it's possible, will go to new assets and whatnot for stream, including some stuff that we have planned. I don't know. Wouldn't say it made a noticeable difference with the noise suppression. Okay, that's fair. But yeah, if you guys want you details regarding the Asuka. optional donathon and the and whatnot, feel free to check out that link. New donation from No Tyke Azafal. No Tyke, <laughs> thank you. As a reminder, actually, um, all the wait, that's twenty five bucks. So from my uh, from the incentives, you should also be getting some free art from me. Yep, you should be getting uh, three free emotes, so if you want to get that uh, squared away, let me know what emotes that you want drawn uh, by me, and I can get uh, those done as soon as I can. Hi. Also, I am going to have food because this has been sitting at my feet for the past... Almost half hour. My fries are cold, but fuck it. I am going to eat them because I, I paid for them. I for 20 seconds and suddenly everything is on fire. <laughs> this girl is on fire! Sorry, getting the excess fries out of my bag. Jesus! I, I don't want to... Oh my god. Hi. This dusk is on VIAAA. <laughs> Go! Get out of here! This now! This is on fire, and so is this guy. And this lamppost. <laughs> now, one thing that I find um, really interesting with Parasite Eve is that there was a completely separate area for the tutorial. There was com a completely separate spot for you to learn the controls. You get a little bit of info, info while in-game, but it's not nearly as in-depth in-game as when you go to the tutorial proper. A lot of older games from the, PS, from the PS1 era and before would typically just kind of throw you in, like just throw you in the water hoping you could swim. And I don't know, as much as I get how annoying and stressful that can be, I kind of miss that kind of a uh, way of like teaching players oh shoot i forgot the graphics in this make it hard to see the flipping steps freeze nypd huh. you are the only one who seems to be fine what oh wow those loading times between areas. I know, right? You should be awakening soon. What? What are you talking about? Listen. Your cells are trying to communicate. Oh, I just realized y'all couldn't hear. Oh, wait, no, you, you can't hear the audio. Ah, I'm so thrown off. They are calling out. Yep. Your okay. cells are trying to communicate. Oh, she's high. Got it. <laughs> no, she's not. For once, we are not dealing with someone who is zooted off their rocker. 
<laughs> What's happening? My body hits. It's out of context. Watch what you're saying, Aya. That could come off so differently. Just as I thought. What? What is this? What did you do to me? Yeah. Shoot your shot. How did that miss me? How did that miss me? You're an easy man to miss, Road. <laughs> Why? Is it because I'm short? Our bodies are communicating with each other. What? Communicating what? What do you want? The more you use that power, the more you will become like me. Power? What power? What are you? Eve. Eve? I'm surprised you don't know me, Aya. You should know me well. What? Short. You mean easier to hold in our arms? <laughs> I don't, uh... Hey, Zelda, you wonderful being, what is adorable this? person, and absolute cutie. Also, handsome and chat, yeah, cuties. <laughs> what was what was that? What is this? What's the this? Hospital room. What's this? Clearly, there's color everywhere. Wait, where are you going? I'm not through with you yet. You gotta admit how much we take voice acting for granted in a lot of games these days, cause... Come back here so I can shoot you more. I, I don't know, I feel like we use, uh, we take voice acting and gaming for granted these days, cause most games today tend to be At voice Fellini acted. Underscore Hailman. But a lot of games before weren't. Like Parasite E, Final Fantasy VII, like even... I am the voice acting, that's part of the fun. I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> I know she's down there. The, the fact that she is doing all this in a dress like that with a split at the side, like, damn. And in heels, too. I can hear the heels. Are you alone? It's dangerous here. You should go. Spindly She's ass fucking legs. She is built different. Like, damn. That girl. It couldn't be. Look, it's not that hard as long as you legitimately don't care about flashing your crotch, and she doesn't strike me as the self conscious sort. I mean, you're not wrong if you got it flaunted, cause damn. Black Widow, eat your heart out. We got a new girl in town. And she could pro Locked. I will forewarn if you guys need a reminder on some of the trigger warnings when it comes to Parasite Eve. You can press explanation point uh, trigger warning. And that should give a rough summary of what we have found to be some uh, sensitive content regarding Parasite just Eve. TW every once in a while slash probably but at the same time i do have um a pinned message regarding like hey if your discretion is advised with the option for folks to input explanation point tw at their discretion i just want to give a reminder of that for those that may be hopping in and don't know what's going on around here that was locked because I will forewarn, there's going to be a good bit of body horror, especially when it comes to some of the enemies. 
not just on humans, but on animals. Case in point... A good bit of body horror good, I've been in Pokemon and Cottage Core for the last while, it's about time we got some proper horror up in things. <laughs> Those are some teeth, nice. There we go. Excuse me. Point blank. Oh wait, I'm out of ammo? When the hell did I get out of ammo? You can't just step on it. No, I don't believe so. Nope, because getting too close to it gives me damage. Where is... Change weapon. Rate of attack times two. Yeah, I am out out of ammo. Switch it to the club. Club. Fuck, 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 fuck. There we go. All right, lost a little bit of health there. All right. Now it gives me ammo. And I know I can get a good bit more ammo coming up. Damn. That club deals a lot more damage. I too. know, right? Like, damn. Jesus. Did Eve do that? Did, did Eve do that to the rat? A what is virgin. going on? What is going on here? Ugh. But like, are they using stun guns or something? She's part of the NYPD, so I'm assuming she's using a proper firearm. Ah! Here, here! Take it! Take everything! It's all on the counter! Don't scare me! I'm with the NYPD! You're the one that scared me! You're the one that scared me, lady! I was just getting ready! You know, only staff are allowed in here! There was an incident here. You'll have to evacuate. What? You're kidding, right? Hey, I'm not hiding here tonight! See ya! <laughs> that fucking scream is about, about as about as bad as fucking the, the as the Wilhelm. Dove deodorant is a better target than me. Like she's clowning around. <laughs> now let's ransack the lockers. Because the lockers are where it's at with getting some extra ammo back. Welcome back. Come on. Oh, there we go. Finally. Think they'd have a change of clothes in one of those lockers? WB. I actually don't know if there's a feature where I uh, can change her clothes. I know in a game that's Thanks. heavily inspired no by... um. I know there's a game that's heavily inspired by PS1 games called Alyssa that does uh, have that. Woo wee! I have heard of scorched earth, but not scorched bodies. Like, damn. Giving flippin' uh, radiation victims a run for their money. They're not scorched, they're just skinned. I mean, true. Medicine, that's going to be helpful. Buffalo Bill is nearby. <laughs> Scorched clowns. You think they tasted funny? They're still alive! Hold on, let me call the paramedics. Melissa, she's a... 
monster. Don't try to talk now. Melissa? Melissa, you mean to be an actress? She's probably got to Suzanne, too. You'll have to stop her. No, please! Wake up! Hate in there! Damn. Wanted to see if there's anything I can get from the table. I won't be going too long with this tonight, namely because I I wasn't expecting to stream tonight, especially solo, but the Nick Tears were having a migraine and they they need they they need time. There we go. Oh no, bird! Hot! Hot! Help! Help! I won't be going too long tonight, damn. I'd have loved to see you keep at it. <laughs> Well, I definitely want to bring this up more often with Horror Pool. I just have to be sure, because I do want to show this to the Nuke Tears. Left for a moment, but now I'm back with dinner. Nice. Welcome back. Hold on. I grabbed too many french fries. I better, I better notify the department about what's happened here. I cannot save my progress, so... Can I help you, buddy? Nope, I cannot. Okay, so I'm just going to... We just gotta go. Oh wait, there was a key somewhere. I remember that there's a key that I can grab. At no tyke is Athel Howdy. No tyke. Hot! Hot! Help! Help! Where is that daggum key? Oh! Hello! The hell was that? Handgun. Oh. Oh, is that a chest? Drop an item. Ah! Uh, you didn't give me that prompt earlier, you dumbass. I need to find that key. I know there's a key in this area that I need to grab. Did I miss it in here? No. But I know what we did miss. Well, first off, a battle. Uh, fuck y'all! Come here. Aw, oh, fuck you. Bap. Damn, 12 ammo? Fucking gimme. Bap, none of rat. <laughs> Let me check in here again to see if there was a key left. No. Do I get the key from this one dude? Come on! As soon as I'm out, more fuckers want to get bapped! Alright, fine. Aw, oh, fuck you. You're really keyed up for that item, huh? Just a bit. Wow! And the- I just noticed also that the, um... The wait time to execute an attack with a club is a lot faster than using- than the handgun. It's the clown. It's 
It's that clown. Melee build. It, the way it's that clown. Engages in glorious from the combat. dressing room. Where is that fucking key? Because I need the key to progress. Because, yeah, this front is locked, right? Yes, it is locked. I need a key. And I know I've gotten it in this area before. Maybe now that you know you need a key in game, it's in the room where you found the skinned girls? Maybe. Maybe. Wrong door. Is there anything I can get off of you? Off of you? No. And I didn't get anything extra from... From the lockers, except for medication. Because I know I've gotten it before. I've play tested this game before on my own time. Wait, don't tell me it was in. Was I a dumbass? Was it in the chest here where I could have put the handgun and they didn't even fucking realize it? Drop an item? No! Okay. Wait! Oh, there's a person here! What's this key? There we go! There we fucking go! I just had to knock down a corpse. What fun. Congratulations. <laughs> it's locked. Let me use the key. Oh, is that not the right key? You son of a bitch. But it's right for this one. Okay. Well, ain't this nice and quaint. More ammo. Nice. Also, let's get the squats in. Also, I'll get uh I'll get water in a bit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, I missed the dialogue. Nine. Ten. Oh no! Evil bird! And just one hit, and down goes the bird. All right. Get that medication. Let's see. Is there anything in here? Ammo! Oh, were those the only... Yeah, because that was the clown's room. Wait, there were doors over further south. Oh, fuck you. Look, I heard a rap burglars, but I don't think this is quite what people talk about. Note to self, try and keep it out of direct range. Hey, 
There we go. What do we got here? That's odd. This wall looks like it's about to crumble. Gonna have more fries. Mmm. I have armor now? Clothes off a of skeleton. That clothes off of the skeleton, apparently. Oh, wait, no, there's a chest here. It's not off of the skelly, it's off of the chest. Let me out. There we go. For complete transparency, I did not grow up with Parasite Eve. Like I said before, this game came out when I was born. So I have no memory with this game. But I do still love retro games considering they hold such a place in nostalgia for me. Namely because also what games I could play as a kid on PS2 alone were heavily limited because of my childhood. So, even though I'm in my 20s, it's nice to be able to play something that is so impactful. Even if it's not quite, quote unquote, of my generation. Parasite powers have evolved to scan, analyze enemies, HP, and weaknesses. Hell yeah! Fuck yeah. Drop an wee item. Woo wee woo wee woo. New. Wee woo. Wee woo. Now can I potentially... Hi, Jaws. Yeah, cutie. <laughs> no, you. Ah, I'm not close enough. I have to get really close in order to hit these guys well. Alright, let's see... If it'll let me unlock the door. No. I need to find a completely separate key. Now I didn't get this far in my playtest. So now is the question of trying to figure out where this other key is. But one place we haven't checked. I'm getting tired. If you need if you need sleep, Toby, go sleep. Wait. That's not a good idea. Alright. Needless to say I'm not trying any speed runs with this game. I got your back, Toby. That was... I was not expecting you... Oh! oh, fuck you. Come here. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. Max HP. Okay. And I, real quick, need to actually... Um, where is it? Where is it? 
use item. I need to use medication real quick. Yep, there we go. Doesn't need to... The. I need to, like, regularly switch between analog e mode. had insomnia last night, so barely slept. Oh. No, that's understandable. I hope you can get some rest soon, because that... First to take oof. care of my gecko. Was there anything in here that I could grab? Oh, fuck you! It a feeding ah. day for him. There's another key somewhere that I need in order to be able to get past that main door. Is there anything in this corner that I can't see? No. Oh heck, BRB. Alrighty. Where is this daggum key? I've already been here. Is it up here? Gotta be somewhere. Watch, the whole rest of the stream is just gonna be me stuck in this area trying to find a fucking key. As if I hadn't been struggling before. Yeah, we'll see what happens. I swear, if I have to look up a walkthrough for this... Oh wait. Oh. Nothing. Damn. I have to go back to... Oh? A diary. November 3rd, Monday. The Christmas show is set. This has been my dream. The main actress has a solo concert at the theater in Central Park. I took all the medication that I took all that medication to get there. I have to K get the K lead back. part. Wait, so this act th this actor drugged themselves in order to be able to try and audition? Sweetheart! I'll even sell my soul to the devil if I have to. November 17th. Ah. The cast was announced and Suzanne and I are double cast. I want to play the part alone, but everyone knows she's good. November 21st, Friday. Look, sometimes you really need the job. Hoy. I mean, you're not wrong. Spee! Spee. I think I'm overdoing it. My body's getting hotter than ever before for some reason. I better take some meds. December 6th, Saturday. I collapsed today. Hi, Selene. Hi, I lost consciousness after my body got hot. I don't care if I die. I just want to get through this show. December 10th, Wednesday. I passed out again. They told me to go to the doctor and get some rest. If this continues, Suzanne will definitely take my part. I need to get better. I better take a lot of medication tonight. 
What this game? I've never heard of it. This is Parasite Eve. It is a body horror sci-fi uh, based on a Japanese novel, actually, of the same name. The game being made in 1998, originally on the PlayStation 1. So, yeah. If you want a reminder or a note on some of the uh, trigger warnings, feel free to oh, type in neat. exclamation point TW. December 11th, Thursday, 2020. Suzanne was burned in an apartment fire. Is it because I wanted the parts so bad? God, forgive me. December 17th, Wednesday. It looks like I'll be the lead. I'd better take more medication and work it. December 23rd, Tuesday. Opening night. Everything went smoothly. Tomorrow's Christmas Eve. We should have the biggest crowd of the season. And I have the, solar con the solo concert the next day at the park. But I'm not feeling well. I better shape up if I want to get the if I want to get through this. I better take more meds. For what? Why is she taking so much? She must have a drug problem. Another key? There we go. That's what I was looking for. Now, actually, let me switch my weapon back to my handgun since I have a shit ton of ammo. Rate of fire, two. How are you saying that I have no bullets? Yeah, ammo crate. That is a good bit of ammo. So I should be fine. Set user preferences. Display position. There we go, just trying- oh! Actually, I don't think that did anything. No, it did. Okay. Just because I see, like, the bottom has a little bit of a black line underneath it, so I want to try and have it somewhat positioned well. Change window color. Oh, I can make it brighter! Completed. Set changed value, set to an... Eh. I don't know if that does much. Sound. It's automatically set to stereo, even though my... I had to do a bit of finagling to try and get the audio set right, because with my... um. With the HDMI converter that I have for my PS2, it actually keeps the audio as mono, and it, there's no way for me to be able to switch it. So I had to manually go into OBS and mess with the audio to make the mono audio come out in both ears. So if the audio is coming out weird, do let me know and I can try and fix it. Okay. Sounds good to me so far. W. E. I'm. Melissa. I'm. No! I'm. I. I'm. I'm. Eve. Oh. Okay, so we're also dealing with some ego death here. I'm... I'm... getting hotter! Nucleic domination has finally come to an end once and for all. What? Oh. 
Oh. Oh my. Fucking Amadeus ass laugh fucking <laughs> Once again The day for the mitochondria to be free has finally arrived Fuck fuck ow Mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. So for context, and it will probably be explained in a bit. Ow. How the, the main story of this game. Oh, hold on. Looks like you still need more time, girl. Until your mitochondria is completely free. Mitochondria? What are you saying? I don't understand you. So you know how the whole thing of like the mitochondria in the body, there are quite a few folks that speculate um, that the mitochondria was a whole other bacteria or similar single-celled organism that began to collaborate with human cells or other cells rather and because of that there's always been uh, a bit I of a theory understand. that's <laughs> because she got a passing grade in biology <laughs> <laughs> okay i go to bed now gecko fed and i must now go to the biological recharging block yeah you get some good you get some good rest Okie Toby, good night. Sorry, I want to wait for the ads to finish up before I try and explain things regarding the plot. Just so that nobody is getting yeah. lost in all this. But the irony given, like, the... the like, the game itself it seems to have lost the plot, but... <laughs> Sleep well, little Sib. Have a good one! Actually, you know what? While I am doing this... back. Alrighty. WB. Alright, so from what I have wait, gathered... Cool. <laughs> the... Oh, wait, yeah. <laughs> you do have a subscription fee! <laughs> Be it from what I have gathered, and it might be explained coming up, but because of the whole Wrong theory kind of, of mitochondria being their own entity that have collaborated with other cells, this uh, series, Parasite Eve, kind of goes into like the theory of what if mitochondria themselves um, had their own that had their own connections and their own interactions that still work even within their collaborations with human cells. So, and that's where we get the concept of a mitochondrial Eve, which I believe is actually also uh, standard in biology or some other science. And because of that, this game and this series takes that concept of a mitochondrial Eve to an extreme of a hive mind. What? Where is this? Is that? Oh, spooky. Is that the little girl I saw? No, it's... Hi, 
I dunno, still sounds like your liver decided it's too important to just be a liver and started ripping your other organs apart to make them something else. <laughs> that doctor... Wait! Mitochondria to be free? Ah. Where did she go? Jump in, let's go. Yeet. Mitochondria or might not. Depends on how much I like Yad. <laughs> I XD. Oh! Oh! Hi! Get away, get away, get away! Let me get him. Not that one! I wanted the one that was closer to me, you dipshit! Come here! Fuck you. There we go. Let me go. Join let me the go. club with them in their heads. <laughs> That's a new enemy. It's a toad? Fuck. Okay. Aw, oh, fuck you. <laughs> Point blank, motherfucker. Come here, come here, come here. Dang, using all the bullets on mobs. I start... I got a shit ton! You can't even- I still have like over 60 bullets! Then again, a lot of these games love to do a resource management. So I probably shouldn't get too much- too ahead of myself. He'll fight the battle toad over a ninja turtle. <laughs> Oh, you! I like that the game is a bullet hell style, one of my favorite types of combats. I don't know, I, I get that, but I'm also unsure on calling it a bullet hell, considering when I think bullet hell, I think of stuff like Toho, where the, the bullets and the projectiles fill up almost the entirety of the screen and you of have course, to figure out tiny bits on where to... Can break. But on like where to like not get hurt. Okay, so I guess I gotta go straight. You were the little girl I saw at the theater. Are you lost? Wait, little girl, yeah, don't it's definitely not go. that crowded, but I like the bird eye view of dodging things XD. Fair. Let me through, let me through. Oh, why won't you let me through? There we go. Those black screens full of black. Ah, oh, fuck you! Damn. Okay, I'm gonna need to heal up soon. Thankfully, I have a surplus on medication. Okay. 
and bunch more ammo. Total, I defeated those enemies. <laughs> Use item. All right, set this back well, to analog. I'm out of dinner now, but at least there's the handsome snack on screen for you to enjoy. <laughs> oh, gate's completely locked. Wait, I missed the dialogue. There's a switch and an emergency phone. The phone is what I used to save, right? Yes. So okay, press the switch. Always touch the switch. Eve! Just... <laughs> hey, come here, bitch. I want your dress. Hold it right there! My body. My body's getting... hot again! <laughs> I is ready to take me on just by herself. Well, even if you... That even if you did have more people with you, they just burned, right? Everyone else but you. You are. Tell me, Eve, why? Why me? Why am I the only one? There can be only one. You'll find out eventually. Even if you don't understand, don't worry. Your mitochondria will. They've always known. I'm going to give you some time. Some time to think and some time to evolve. And the day shall arrive when you will Why me? awaken. Because they eat fun and she's got the least fun of all. <laughs> Touch the switch. Okay. Pokes Road. <laughs> so they're technically amorphous? Damn! Oh, that was gnarly. What the fuck are you? Ah, look over there! I'm pulling a really shitty old now Z accent to try and do this bit, but I'm already fucking losing it! <laughs> Water through us. Oh, you're a big boy! Two targets?! LMAO. Woo! <laughs> that was lucky! <laughs> fuck, fuck, fuck! Ow! Off! Off of me! Off of me! Oh! So that's what a IRL do duel looks like. Let me go, let me go! Note to self, don't get near my corner! Fuck! 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 Alright, do another. Plan of medication, use. He just wants a Full health, full health, full! Chikoski! Oh! His tail and his head. Oh! Mama! Here, have some extra armor. Oh, 
how am I doing so little damage? Oh, I'm not doing... Fuck. Oh. Oh, he's angry. He's an angry boy. Ow. Do another thing to meds. Whoa! Ow! Fuck! Yeah! Woo! -hoo -hoo. Ow! Woo! -hoo. At least I have some revives. Woo! That would have been bad! Damn! Damn! Okay. the gods. Really? Only half health? Oh, you cock! Oh, fuck. Alright, revive number two. I'm probably gonna have to look up how I'm supposed to beat up this asshole. And he's got me fucking cornered. Yes, son of a bitch. Okay, I think I actually get the pattern. I need to prioritize going at his tail. Ow. That was dumb. Yeah, because doing that fuck, fuck, huh, huh? Not surprised boss like corners. It's Fuck! always 90 degrees. No! There's a second phase for this asshole! I did not think that they would be doing multi-phase bosses this fucking early! And now he has laser beams. Nice. Oh, and I'm too far away to do good damage. Keep him somewhat still. Okay, that's not quite enough damage. Fuck! Oh! Okay, now I know what to do. And let me get the cute box. Damn! First death of the... Oh, fuck! And I just realized because I don't have 
a working PS1 memory card. I have nowhere to save to, so I have to do that all over again. About an hour and a half of progress just fucking down the fucking train because I have a working PS1 memory card. Oh, heck. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> fuck you too, game. <laughs> fuck you too. Bye, yeah, goof. Big oof. Big fucking oof. Hi. Hey, Apple! Hope you're doing well! Uh, <laughs> we're having to completely redo oh, Parasite seven. Eve because... Hello, oh, slash. The PS1 memory card that I was given when I got my new PS2 does not work. I am still waiting on my old PS2 and all of my games, including my old memory cards, to come back to me. I've been waiting almost a month, and, they, and the folks that have my shit Keep saying, oh, we have to wait on corporate to give us an okay and shit. It has been over a month. I want my shit so that I can actually save my progress for a game like this. Ah! Dagum! Also, we do have early bird uh, go uh, stuff goings on for the optional uh, donathon I'm that we have going on. To wrangle my drawing app. It's trying to crop my PNG when I save. Oh! Playing the game in hardcore mode. Let's go. Basically, this is hardcore mode because I cannot save. I cannot save right now because I have nothing to save it on. Oh, this irks me. This fucking irks me. <laughs> and what's a little more annoying is that with... Um... With this game, none of the cutscenes are skippable. Like, the dialogue is skippable. Sure, you can run through it somewhat quick. But, there's only so much that can be done. Oh, wait, is this Parasite Eve? This is Parasite Eve! I have a physical copy in my PS2 oh right my now, God. and I am playing you with a proper DualShock. I am going OG with this shit. <laughs> well, nothing to worry about if you just dodge everything and never die, right? XD. Uh, <laughs> you wanna play this game, Speed? Finally, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You've been waiting for someone to play Parasite Eve, haven't you, Apple? I fucking fixed it. Oh, nice! When I have, um... Noise. When I have my working PS1 memory card, I honestly want to get through this game. I I love the mechanics. I love the graphics of it, the aesthetic. And to be quite honest, I have it. I have the game. I may as well fucking play it. <laughs> like, come on. But just right now, because I am newbie baby boy with Parasite Eve, I do not have the means to be able to save this and be able to keep at it. And there's no way in hell that I can learn about trying to play You're this like, 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 I guess nightmare mode, having no way to save. <laughs> and actually, I'm going to have to refund you because I have a new uh, battery 
uh, coming in because my old one is dead. It broke on me and it no longer works. Oh. So let me get that refunded to you if I can. Oh geez, I just realized I forgot to do a thing because I ignored my alarm earlier Xed BRB. Oh no! <laughs> Alright, let me complete all of these. So we're going through some nice little dialogue and whatnot. Rather, we're going to breeze the hell through as Aya just chucks her that chucks her date. Buyeta to the death with this game ist. I'm glad it's you playing this and not me. No, understandable. I'm normally not a fan of horror myself, but... It's easier for me to be able to watch than it is to play, but especially given the fact that this is a PS1 game and the graphics of the PS1 are not really that scary to me, it makes this a lot more palatable, at least for me. Like, I could even say that I could safely be able to play, like, OG, OG um, Resident Evil and Silent Hill based on the graphics alone. Silent Hill may be a little iffy, but Resi, OG Resi, definitely. Oh, I like horror, but this game is very close to unplayable. What makes you say that? I'm curious. Like, I know people tend to call it a difficult game, but its mechanics are not that bad, at least to me. You just have to worry about folk. You just have to focus on enemy patterns. Well, at least the clown will keep their humorous this time. <laughs> oh, I keep forgetting about the parasite, uh, the parasite energy. It's the mobs. Oh, true. I would not be surprised if there's a way that you could, like, just keep grinding on mobs for a while, especially with the club, and end up being just ridiculously OP by the time you get to the first, uh, by the first time you get to the first boss. Also, theory, because I don't remember the whole story on... I said theory, not Siri! Shut the fuck up, phone! <laughs> that was a TH sound, not an S sound, you dolt. Anyway, I guess I have to work on my wording hypothesis for this game, because I don't remember the whole story for Parasite Eve. This girl is Aya, and she was experimented Siri on... Siri wants to become Navi. Siri wants to become Navi, apparently. Definitely. Daggum! <laughs> also, folks, don't tell me if I'm right or wrong with that. I kind of... I, I kind of want to experience this. What was that? Let's get through the dialogue. Let me, let me go, let me go. Man, the depth perception with these games was so jank, though. No worries, this be the first I've seen of this game XD. <laughs> I'm 
actually curious to know if anyone has seen anyone else play Parasite Eve before. Because I definitely want to uh, play this to completion. You're not right or wrong. You're road. <laughs> but yeah, just need to go. Nope, not that one. I forget which one is unlocked. Oh, you gotta see the I'm rat just first. Happy you're Body my horror. First experience Body. With this. <laughs> If you oh, hear screaming from a no, Tay, I'm me your know first? I'm with bated well, breath. damn. <laughs> if you hear screaming from a sucky bay, let me know. I'm I'm waiting with bated breath. Oh, no, I was poking Lexi to see if she wanted to, like, watch this. I haven't heard anything from her. I know she's been a busy bee. like the skull extends and protrudes out of the uh, out of the skin like that like damn that is visceral <sighs> fuck you i deserve that oh i'm aware too but i finished a project that we've both been excited about nice this is also my first time seeing anything about this game well damn if i knew i was gonna be people's first <laughs> i would have done something better I would have hoped that I could have had, like, my memory cards and that this would be a lot better, damn! Talk to you... Come on! Oh wait, I need to ransack your shit first. Meds, nice. There we go. Crinks TV also did a playthrough of this, I think. Ooh, nice. Actually, Apple, speaking of like older games, I am planning to do a playthrough of um, Spirit Camera, as in the, the, uh, the 3DS version of Fatal Frame on the week of Halloween. Let me go, let me go, let me go, let me go. I know nothing is in that last. You can be walker. my first for anything anytime. <laughs> you don't know how tempted I was uh, to give. Especially because of that scream, you don't know how tempted someone in my system was to give him a fucking Chuckles voice. Like, I know it's more like Mad Hatter, like probably the inspiration that the player for Chuckles the Clown did for that voice, but goddamn, it is so iconic. There's the ammo. Yep. Gotta go up here. I am an elder god made flesh. <laughs> I am an elder god made flesh. Mustard? How about mustard gas? <laughs> god, that's a pravity with Chuckles the Clown, though. I love Chuckles so much. Same. I know there's a few spots that we can check on. 
Now that we have the one key... I know we need to look in here. I feel like causing chaos. Depends on the kind of chaos that you're thinking. Well, let's read the diary because that'll give us a new key. Come on. Channel chaos. Channel chaos? <laughs> I mean, go for it. We got about uh, 40. Uh, 24 minutes of stream left because I will be ending at midnight my time. It's 11.36, so I am just chilling right now doing a playtest. <laughs> Alright, pretty on the squats and the water. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, Add no tigers, Athel, it's no use. Nine and ten. What do you got to say, bird? Oh wait, no. You You turn. At Apple underscore. You turn and wanna hurt me, so I'm going to leave you be. Thank you for the noms. I've actually already been munching on my dinner. And it is very cold because I have been focused on the game <laughs> because I am I am dumb. Very new. Got recommended you by a archivist. We're a system as well and planning to do streams. Oh heck yeah! Can't stay for long right now, but hi. Hello. Hi there! Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, fun guys. And yeah, we will actually be ending somewhat early at uh, midnight, so Hello. we have a little over 20 at minutes left. Howdy. But thank you for for sticking around. WB Lupin. Also, welcome back, Spee. I am out of chaos points, pleading face. <laughs> I recognize them from A's stream. Nice. Yeah, uh, the fun guys did say that they came from uh, Archivist community. At the Zelda player 99, oh yeah, yeah, haha. Ha. Oh, I forgot about you coming out of the closet. Look, I know we need to support, but <laughs> ah, I am. Look, I, I, I know we love our monster fuckers here, but I don't think this is quite how we want to go at it, bud. Is it? Okay, small tangent. I, I feel like there's a few ways you could easily tell that someone is Midwestern. Them saying bud, them saying ope, um, the Midwestern goodbye. Like saying, oh yeah, well I gotta I, I gotta take care of something. But then they just keep getting pulled in conversation. And coming from someone that was raised in the Midwest, I I, I know for a fact that I that I am an example of that to a fucking T. We'll put that on. And hey, nothing wrong with yapping. We have our own bits oh, of yapping. God. Midwestern goodbyes are just like Hispanic goodbyes. I actually know little when it comes to Hispanic goodbyes, so I can't say yay or nay on that. I'm kind of curious on what you mean, though. Hi, bird! Oh, 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 woo! Oh, I need to heal soon.
Well, Healy might not... You know, yeah, we do still need to heal. Even if this game is not going to be saved. <laughs> because I don't have a working fucking PS1 memory card. Because mine is still Just in the fucking shop. Hi. Then someone brings up an interesting topic, and then commences another two hours of talking right by the door. Freedom just out of reach XD. Oh no, that's a fucking mood. For, I don't know, for, for Midwestern goodbyes, it's more of like, people getting roped into conversations that aren't really interesting, but more you kind of feel socially obligated to stick around and talk about because of the gravity of the topic or because it relates to other topics that have been said regardless of how interesting they are it's more of a it's more of a adhering to other people and other people's uh sensitivities rather than actually asserting boundaries midwestern culture is a lot about not having your own boundaries at least that's what I gathered with being raised in Ohio. Do I have it? Yes. Only in Ohio slash J. <laughs> The fact this lady loses her legs, though. There's a really airy beauty to her, though, given the fact that she looks almost like a rose. Whoa! Oh, I perfectly dodged that! Yeah, bitch! Ah! I didn't dodge that one. That was lucky. <laughs> ah, damn it. You stay the fuck put. I ran right into that. Fuck you. Come on. Let me go. All right, now that I know the pattern with the croc, is there anything over here? Nope, that is just a mirror. Oh yeah, that's probably a better description of the never ending goodbyes, yet XD. <laughs> All right, now let's just go. Now that I know roughly the pattern of the croc, I have to go for his tail first. Oh, I haven't leveled up a whole lot. <laughs> I only have- oh, I actually need to... I probably ought to, um, grind a bit so that I have more gear. There has to be some ammo that I missed. Oh no, I can't go back! Ah, uh, I'm fucked. 
I'm fucked. You know what? We have 14 minutes till the end of stream, so I'm just going to gun it. Wait, no, I only have 30 ammo. I only have 30 ammo. That's not going to be enough to go against the croc. Not even. So I'm going to switch to the club. Let's grind a little bit here in the sewer. I want to get on the steps, please and thank you. Am I not able to get on the steps? Oh. Oh boy. Oh, I walked right into that. All right, let's use one of the meds. How is that not hitting? I am right on you. Ow. Well, this is not gonna be a good run. <laughs> I need to remember how to use the parasite powers. Ow. Oh, I am almost dead. You know what? Okay, put me out of my misery. Come on, big guy. There we go. <laughs> Game over. God damn. Damn, so much for me trying to get to the croc again. <laughs> Fucking hell. All right, you know what? I think I'm just going to chill for like the rest of, of the night. We have like, t yeah, you know, I had another death. <laughs> Let me switch the audio off of mono. Dag, um. <laughs> I definitely need um my PS1 card to play this because otherwise I just keep going in a loop. Uh, but this is definitely something I want the nuke tears in on. Oof. Ah, but now I'm actually curious, are there some other Sorry, I got the hiccups. Horror games that you, that you guys are curious on. Ah. Like, I know well, I'm... Stop getting hit. Then slash LH slash... Because <laughs> I know there's a few horror games that, like, the Nukes, Harris, and I want to introduce to each other. Me having much less of a selection than they. <laughs> Um, I know some of the games that we have that lean onto horror and scares a little bit are like Inscription, um, The Hex, you could argue uh, Hollow Knight, um, let me see, we have a few others, Waltz of the Wizard probably not, it's more like an infinite dungeon, but it does have scares with you being like actively in on the action. Um, oh come on. There's also Erotic Tosis. 
uh, that we have. Trying to see what other ones we have. I know that they have Resident Evil. I mean, I'd like to see your reaction to Lollipop Chainsaw, but that's more campy. I've heard good things on Lollipop Chainsaw. Let's see, we have Benny and the Dark Revival, Benny and the Ink Machine, Boris and the Dark Revival, though given a lot of the actions lately out their studio, we might want to hold off on that. Um, the Cat Lady, I know that the Nicktares have been playing. Uh, let's see, the Crooked Man, Mad Father, Dark Souls. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. We have a few that we could potentially choose from. But I'm also curious to know if you guys know oh, any. Oh, Bendy and the Ink Machine and the Crooked Man. I'm curious to know if you guys have any that you guys would want, want to see. We do have Fear and Hunger. I know Lexi and the others have been playing it. I keep trying. I originally bought Fear and Hunger for the Duke Tears last year, and they still haven't fucking played it. The coma. <laughs> the coma? Wait, brain is not connecting. Fear and hunger time. <laughs> Wait, I don't even have the mod downloaded on this. I can't play that on Twitch. Not without the mod, Twitch would kill me. Trying to see what other ones. <gasps> I forgot we got Canedo Pet. Oh! oh I forgot you have to censor mod at XD. The Coma One and Two is a stalker type horror. Korean ghost adventure stuff. Ooh! Tiny Bunny is a good horror game. See. Tiny Bunny. I don't think we have that one. Uh, we have little nightmares. We have Miso. It had a full proper HD it's remaster this year, though. apparently. I don't know how many chapters are out now. Uh, we do have the Mortuary Assistant. I've tried the Mortuary Assistant before, and that, oh, that rattles me. <laughs> uh, we apparently have Pathologic 2. Do. Yep, we have Resi 7, we have Resi Reverse, we have Resident Evil Village. Uh, we have Sally Face, Episode 1. Nice. By we, I mean, this is predominantly also the Nick Terrace oh, library that I have. Remaster. Both are on Steam. Ooh, okay. noise. Yay. Yeah, I'm curious. Who here knows Kanito Pet, the game? Because if people are curious on it, I could play it at some point. It's kind of a one-time uh, playing experience, honestly, uh, where... I don't it really know anything that hasn't been suggested yet. A sci-fi survival horror game of sorts that's still under development, maybe, ah. but don't think it's horror enough. I do not know it. Also, what in the world? Oh, that was that's from. It's a pronoun tag. I need to cut that from below just a little bit more. Apparently, here we go. But so, Kanito Pet is a game made from inspiration of, like, say, Bonsai Buddy and certain. Uh, you could probably argue also like uh, Shimeji's, um, basically desktop mascots. However, Kinito Pet, this little creature goes on like a yandere level of, you're my best friend, right? Right? And it actually took the devs of a while to, grounds. it took oh God, the, no. It took the devs a little bit to actually create a patch in it that so with the experience 
unless you are now in streamer mode, it gets access to your webcam and it can dox your face if you don't put it in streamer mode. <laughs> Oh, Dotto. Oh, yeah! <laughs> it's an experience, though. Oh, wow, XD. I've seen a lot of folks, like, play it, and I've been tempted to want to play it myself. Rotodusk underscore VT, do you just want me to send you a list? I think that would be a good idea, Apple. Thank you. <laughs> While I'm doing that, actually, let me see who all is alive okay. right now. Now we might raid out to... You know what? Considering uh, they're having their 2.0... Why don't... Or at least I thought that they were having their 2.0. Creepy toys uh, that are alive and yandera creep me the heck out. X sounds like a fun game, haha. Right? But you know what? Unless uh, anyone wants us to raid out to someone else, which you're free to request via the guide, the raid point redeem, I think we're going to raid out to Ericvist. Um, They are currently playing... The looks like he's currently playing uh, Phoenix Wright, actually. So something a little bit lighter <laughs> than what we've got tonight. <laughs> but yeah, I do. Funnily enough, I have his stream up on my other phone. Nice. Nice, nice. Gotta support two handsome lads. <laughs> Alrighty. I I want to wait until it's like midnight proper that we head off to give Ericvist, uh some support. Thankfully, everything looks to be up to snuff. But yeah, really hope that y'all enjoyed this little... <laughs> uh, this little tidbit regarding uh, Parasite Eve. Because, holy moly, I did not expect Parasite Eve to actually be this fun. And I am seriously looking forward to doing stuff on my PS2 more often, especially since I have Dot Hack Infection and Mutation. I just need the other two games in Kite Saga, and I could so do the whole series. I've wanted to do the whole Dot Hack series, especially for Haseo's Saga, for a while now. <laughs> and this is only just lighting a bigger fire under me. <laughs> Sorry if the tippy taps from my keyboard were too loud there. All right, we are just about to hit midnight, so let's actually get the raid message. Thanks for the stream, Road. Yeah, not a problem. And let me mute the TTS before it goes haywire. So there's the version for the message for followers. There's the version for uh, passers-by. And here's the version for subscribers. Let's raid out to Ericvist. Let me be sure that I'm spelling his name right. And I did. Ha ha! Do you know the ball to sit on the stream? This is not the end of our time together as the road to dusk will always be open for another adventure. Thank you all so, so much for sticking around. Please have a wonderful rest of your morning, afternoon, evening. Whatever time it is in your time zone, as we say. Bye-bye!